Welcome to today's video, a crystal water bottle review. And then the stone removes like that completely. Comparison of their first generation and their second generation. <laughs> Hey everyone and welcome to today's video, a crystal water bottle review, Soji Energy's Generation 2 water bottle. My name is Aislinn and on this channel we share some of our family vlogs, some of my mommy videos, and have product reviews from time to time. So if you're new, please consider subscribing and become part of our family here. And if you want to know more about anything you see here on this channel, be sure and check the links in the description below this video or leave a comment. I'd love to connect with you there. Some of you may remember the last crystal water bottle review that I did. Soji Energy has came out with a generation 2 water bottle and so I'm back with another review for you guys today. Our first water bottle that we had was stolen on a trip that I took to Florida and, and if you've been watching for a while you may remember that that water bottle I got for Micah for Father's Day on a trip that we took to Mount Rainier. Since I lost it, I felt pretty bad and had to get him a new one. And I know you're probably wondering, what was I doing with it on a trip going to Florida? But I usually kept it in my mom bag, so then when we were going places, there was just always water for any of us. Anyway, if you want to check out either of those videos, the review, or when we gave it to him for Father's Day, I'll be sure and link those in the description below and you can check them out later. I wanted to start off with saying I was pretty bummed when I looked into getting one of these. They actually weren't selling them at the time. They were working on the revamp of their water bottle. I reached out to them and was curious when they were going to be back in stock. And when they responded back, they said that they were working on making the attachment inside plastic and so the stone would then be interchangeable and that it was going to hold more water. So those were things that I was super excited to hear. So the stone in this one is their clear quartz. We had a smoky quartz in our other one. It was so super beautiful. I liked it actually more than this stone. And if you remember, it was just a really beautiful stone. This stone is beautiful as well. I felt like it was a little bit smaller than the stone that came in the other water bottle. So as you can see, they come apart here. So I'm going to show you the stone up close really quick. It is just absolutely beautiful how it catches the light. So remember, if you want to know anything more about this water bottle, be sure and check the links in the description below this video. So this is also the way that you can clean it. The top comes off here for drinking. They did change the top of the water bottle so it doesn't have a string. So the base can twist out like this and then the stone removes like that completely. So that I think is a super great feature for this water bottle. Stones are known to have different meanings and purposes and intentions. So if you're needing to switch up your stone for the day, it's super convenient. That makes this water bottle much better to me than their last water bottle. I did like the way the metal looked over the plastic because I'm not a big fan of plastic, but I definitely like that it allows this option for this bottle. And I actually have another water bottle so I'm gonna show you so we can compare the two so you can see kind of what the other one was like we have this one it's soji as well and so that's the difference in the two bases the stones look pretty comparable in size I think this one is actually not I don't know that this one is a hundred percent the stone that's supposed to be with this water bottle I question if it got changed I did purchase this one off of eBay and the stone is super loose in it so be careful where you're purchasing your water bottles from. You can hear that. Another thing Soji did different is the new generation has the white logo, the old generation has the black logo. I have another water bottle here and I feel like this one shows you the difference in stones and the size. This is not from a Soji Energy water bottle. I will link down here on the bottom the Instagram account for the person that I found this one through. But when you put the stones together, you can see that this one looks a little bit larger than the white one. Definitely more so at the base too. I like the way this stone looks way more than this stone. The new generation water bottle is a little bit more than the last generation water bottle, but for the upgrades, I think that's pretty cool. There you can see the string attached to this water bottle over this water bottle. So that wraps it up for comparison of their first generation and their second generation water bottle. 
I'll add here really quick that if you enter in a code at checkout, you can get a free piece of amethyst with your purchase. I definitely like the piece that we got with our other purchase better. It would be neat. I wish I had it to show you in comparison, but that one is probably back in our storage unit in Oregon. If you're new to our channel, we've moved to Maui. But yeah, this works as a beautiful little piece of decoration to put like in your workspace or something. Soji Energy water bottles come with an awesome sleeve to keep it covered in and when you don't have it covered, it's normally a really great conversation piece. And it is always fun when you run into a fellow crystal lover. I'll give you a peek inside the packaging. It comes all in separate pieces and the stones so then when you get it, you just piece it together. I showed you guys the box in the last video, they haven't really changed that. and then. There is a little card, it says Crystal Quartz Elixir Water Bottle, Clarity, Power, Inspiration, and Wisdom. They are very fragile, so if you have one, be sure to handle it with care. And when you first get it, make sure to rinse it and give your stone an intention. I wanted to read really quick on the back. It says, Clear Quartz is known as the Master Healer. It is a very powerful healing stone that can be used for anything and everything. Clear Quartz is translucent and clear is known to increase inspiration and creativity by creating space in the mind. It can heal issues at the physical, mental, emotional, and soul level. Clear Quartz resonates with the higher chakras, bringing in divine white light and connection to the higher self, higher consciousness, higher wisdom, and unconditional pure love. Soji Crystal Elixir Water Bottles are made with 100% safe quartz crystals. If you're considering exploring other homemade elixirs, we encourage you to do your research and some crystals are not safe to place in your drinking water. And also, Keep in mind the type of water that you're putting in your Soji Energy water bottle. We prefer to drink alkaline already. Crystals are known to help raise the pH levels of water. And there's some scientific background about what crystals do to your water. And then they say some of it's not proven. So it's interesting to see the information that you can find when researching on the internet. Either way, having healing thoughts and doing things that are good for your body are important to do. And that is something we strive for here on our channel and for ourselves and for our family and our babies. I also wanted to add that this is not a sponsored video. We just really love our crystal water bottles and I wanted to share it with you guys. So that about wraps it up for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Again, I have links in the description below. If you need to know anything more, drop me a comment, check out those links. And if you did enjoy this video, be sure and give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing and we'll see you in our next video. Thank Thanks so much for watching. Bye. Let's go surfing now. Everybody's learning now. Come on a safari with me.